7 Best EMF Detector Apps in 2020 Concerns about electromagnetic field EMF, radiation have been on the rise in recent years. We know that almost every electronic device at home or the office emits electromagnetic radiation. We also know that this presents various health dangers to you when you are exposed. For this reason, a lot of people wish they could measure the amount of EMF radiation they are exposed to. How will you know which electronic devices emit radiation and how much they are emitting? Professional EMF tools like EMF meters and EMF detectors apps are some of the tools you can use to measure EMF radiation from each electronic device you use or are near to. These tools allow you to measure radiation from your fridge, let you know if you have any EMF leaks from your microwave and even tell you how much radiation your Wi-Fi router exposes you to. There are various EMF detector apps that you can choose based on your needs as a user. Just like when you use an EMF meter, the EMF detector apps measure the amount of radiation emitted by electronic devices. Different types of EMF meters measure different types of radiation, therefore, if you want to measure a certain type of electromagnetic radiation, make sure to choose the right tool. There are EMF detectors that measure low-frequency electromagnetic radiation that is emitted by power lines, while other types of detectors measure high-frequency radio waves from Wi-Fi routers or microwave ovens. A good EMF meter should be able to measure the three main types of EMF radiation, radio frequency, RF, electric, and magnetic field radiation. And by the way, if you want to minimize the EMF radiation you are exposed to in your daily life, I highly recommend checking out the first link in the description below this video. Do EMF detector apps work? EMF detector apps on Play Stores and App Stores are becoming very popular. So, do EMF detector apps really work? Yes, but they are not as accurate as an actual EMF meter. These apps allow you to measure EMF radiation through your smartphone, which is also a source of high-frequency EMF radiation. These apps can help you read EMF radiation, but they're not an ideal replacement for a real EMF meter. The detector apps only measure EMF radiation emitted by telecommunication devices. For instance, you can use the EMF app on your smartphone to measure Wi-Fi radiation, Bluetooth, and radiation from 2G, 3G, 4G and 5G networks. Most electronic components emit electric field radiation. Since we use so many of these in the home, in the office and on the go, this is the most important type of radiation you need to measure. Unfortunately, the majority of EMF detector apps measure the magnetic fields that are emitted by the earth or other magnetic components around you like speakers, or magnets in your headset. The apps measure magnetic field radiation in Gauss and Tesla units. Very few of them measure electric field radiation. How EMF detector apps work Since EMF detector apps only measure radiation from communication technologies, they mostly record EMF reading when you approach a Wi-Fi router, laptop or when you are close to a cell phone that is actively on a call. These apps may not give you an accurate measure of EMF radiation since the cell phone you're using to measure radiation is also emitting radio frequency RF, radiation. Therefore, the smartphone itself will interfere with the EMF readings. The detector app works by displaying a spike in the meter reading when it goes near devices using RF. Since the cell phone itself communicates using radio frequency, it is the spike that is measured. The app picks up and reads the extra radio frequencies from other devices instead of from itself. You may not have accurate results because some apps can pick up and read the magnets in the phone and give you magnetic field radiation readings. For these reasons, for most purposes, the detector apps are not the best way to detect EMF radiation. The only time I can recommend the use of these apps is if you have bought an EMF protective product, such as a case for your phone, tablet or laptop, and you want to test if it's working. If you have an EMF meter or detector app, you can measure the amount emitted by your phone and be able to see the difference the anti-radiation cases make. You can simply make a call when the anti-radiation phone case is opened and record the EMF readings. Make another call when the phone case is closed and record the EMF readings. You will notice a significant difference in the amount of radiation emitted when properly using the anti-radiation phone case. Also, I just want to quickly mention that if you're all concerned about EMF radiation, you should take a second and check out the first link in the description. The Best EMF Detector Apps 1. ELECTRO SMART FREE EMF DETECTOR APP ELECTRO 
Smart is a Google Play Store app that enables you to identify new sources of EMF exposure. It is very simple to use. You don't need to be a technician to understand whether your exposure rate is very high, moderate, or low. This app measures electric field radiation from communication technologies like the Wi-Fi routers, Bluetooth devices and from 2G, 3G, 4G, and 5G networks from different cellular antennas. By using this app, you will know how much radiation each is emitting. The ElectroSmart will display the devices that have high radiation exposure by name. Therefore, if you're experiencing high exposure, ElectroSmart will indicate whether it's from your Bluetooth device or Wi-Fi router. It also acts as a watchdog that notifies you when you go into areas with high exposure to radiation. This device tracks your EMF exposure. Each day, the app keeps statistics of your exposure. It keeps on monitoring radiation from nearby devices and records the exposure. If you experience electrosensitivity symptoms such as headaches, fatigue, dizziness and inability to sleep, you should download the app and test the radiation around you. 2. Electromagnetic Detector EMF Scanner This is one of the detector apps on the Apple Store. You can download the app on your Apple device and scan electromagnetic radiation around you. The detector app can pick up radio frequency signals from different devices within your environment. It is very easy to use an electromagnetic detector app, and you can download it for free. It also has some premium features which you have to pay for if you want to use them. The app allows you to send an email with all the measurements daily. If you configure the email feature on the app, it will automatically send you an email with the radiation levels. It has an audible beep that is activated to alert you when the app detects EMF readings of a certain level. The apps continuously monitor your surrounding environment and give off an alert when high EMF radiation is detected. This app helps you keep a record of EMF readings for a certain period of time. If you want to keep taking EMF readings for your Wi-Fi access point, then this is the best app to use. It allows you to keep up to 100 readings. 3. Ultimate EMF Detector Ultimate Electromagnetic Field Detector is one of the best Android apps you can get. It is very simple with an easy-to-use interface. This type of app works by using the magnetic sensor used for running the compass in your phone. Installing the Ultimate Detector app will allow you to accurately measure the magnetic field radiation, just like the sensor in your device. The latest smartphones come with a magnetic sensor feature on them. If your phone doesn't have this feature, you will not be able to get the readings. It will always show you zero readings. You should also avoid going near power transformers. They are powerful electrical devices and then it will damage your phone sensor. Ultimate EMF Detector app comes in two versions, the free version and the pro version. The free version. It measures magnetic field radiation using micro Tesla, Gauss and milli Gauss units. It has a recorder that stores data in the form of a text file on a computer for future use. For you to use this external storage feature, you need permission to read and write to the device. Your smartphone screen stays on when using the app. It displays the measurement in the form of graphs or use of min and max features. It has a classic EMF meter display that features needle and L.E.D. The Pro Version all the features of the free version. It has no ads. It has a timer for the recorder feature. There is a sound notification when you go in areas with high exposure or when there is a sudden change in the readings. It features several backgrounds and skins. 4. Entity Sensor Pro EMF Detector This is one of the popular Android EMF and EVP detectors. It also had a recorder. The app uses the EMF sensor, your phone's magnetic sensor, to read the magnetic field in the surrounding environment and record the readings. The app is marketed for ghost hunters because of its electronic voice phenomenon, EVP, feature for automatically recording audio data. The recorded data can be stored in an external storage unit like your computer for further analysis. You can use the graphs feature on your phone to display the data. The base app is linked to Android Wear Watch app. This allows you to measure EMF readings directly on your watch. The screen watch is always off but it will vibrate whenever you go near an increased level of EMF activity. The Entity Sensor Pro EMF app also has premium features which include
a record trigger option that allows you to automatically start or stop recording of electromagnetic frequency or EVP. A media enhancement option that features a camera with flashlight, a high quality EVP recorder and other playback buttons on the screen. A Google Drive integration that automatically uploads the recorded EMF slash EVP files to your Google Drive account. Vibration detect option, when enabled, is able to detect any movement or vibration on your phone. 5. EMF Analyzer This detector app measures EMF emissions from paranormal objects you come across in your everyday activity. It utilizes a tri-axis magnetic sensor that enables you to measure the presence of EMF devices and the strength of the emission. The sensor combines the recorded data to make it easy to read on the screen. It provides you with real-time electromagnetic frequency readings and displays data in numeric form. It also uses graphs to help you identify any data anomalies. It also helps interpret the readings which are already displayed in micro. Tesla. 6. EMF Radiation Detector. This EMF detector app works with Android phones that have a magnetic sensor to measure magnetic fields in micro Tesla units. The set EMF level is about 49 micro Tesla or 490 milligauss. Once the app detects electromagnetic devices such as laptops and speakers around you, it increases the micro Tesla values. The EMF detector app works by detecting radiation from different devices around you. It also detects low levels of different types of radiation such as EMF and magnetic field. 7. Wi-Fi Radiation Exposure Meter this app is used to measure Wi-Fi radiation around you. You can use the free version or the paid version. The paid version has more features and it's more accurate than the free version. Watch this YouTube video to see how this app helps you measure the radiation from your Wi-Fi router. It is easy to use due to its interactive interface. The app has various features that allow you to do a lot of tasks. The app measures radiation in decibel or milliwatt then converts the measurements into electrical field values. The users see results displayed in volts per meter. The app is only designed to pick up radiation coming from your Wi-Fi router at home or in the office. Summary The majority of the EMF detector apps are used to measure magnetic field radiation. For this reason, having the app is not a guarantee that you're safe from exposure from other types of radiation. For example, most of the communication technologies around us emit high levels of radio frequency RF signals. If the detector app you're using can't detect the radio frequency signals, then they will leave you exposed to a lot of radiation. The detector apps run through your smartphone which is also a source of RF radiation. The phone itself emits radiation, which makes it difficult to know the actual amount of radiation you're exposed to from other electronic devices around you. Some of the apps that help detect radiation from communication technologies devices will produce a beeping sound or vibrate whenever you go near the radiation emitting device. You will also note an increase in the micro Tesla units recorded for each emitting device. The best way to use these detector apps is when you have anti-radiation phone cases which minimize your exposure to EMF radiation from your cell phone. The EMF detector app will be able to measure the radiation before and after using the cases. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more useful tips and tricks and visit imfgardtips.com. Thanks for watching.